Okay guys, real quick tip here. If you spilt a bunch of water or even had a major flood indoors or outdoors, uh, here's a quick tip. Get all your uh, main, main cleaning done, like uh, m mats, I guess it's called a mat. Things like that should just be wrung out because it's easier to get water out of them like that rather than blotting it. And... Um, use rags, put rags down, and then just wring them out. Just use a big towel at first. I mean, you just get a gallon, get a gallon, yeah. Just get a huge, you get a lot with that. And then just wring it out wherever. And you can even hold them in front of this to let them dry out. Uh, it works. I'll get into the whole hot air thing very soon. That's, uh, it's more important than you think. But don't rest them on it. I had one actually start to catch on fire. Um, apparently that goes over 415 degrees Fahrenheit. I think it is. Uh, anyways, why this is important to have one of these blowing. Uh, particularly in the direction of something that you don't want getting wet. Keep it blowing that way. But far enough away so that uh, it could run forever and not you know catch something on fire that's your own thing and don't set it in water and don't run with scissors whatever whatever because anyways if you have this stuff if you have hot air going towards uh, or over or anywhere around moisture it will make that moisture more likely to evaporate because hot air uh, can hold more moisture than uh, cooler air could so if you do this, and in this room there's an exhaust fan. At first I thought to turn the exhaust fan on, but I'm having a epiphany maybe. Okay, let's say you, for instance, you, let's try and figure it out. Let's say you keep the exhaust fan off. This whole room is going to start gaining moisture in the air, and your goal is to get as get this room access to as much colder, which is drier, probably drier air coming in here. You need as much of that as you can and as much as this hot air that has the moisture going out, but not just hot air from the fan. You want hot air with moisture, so position it right. And that hot air with moisture should uh, be given ample time to rise and then ideally um, that that will work that works I saw the, the that hot air will be pulled out of the fan and this will then be a negative pressure and the only other source of air is my room and the open window I won't give away where I live and it will be definitely cooler, less humid air coming in. So that's it. That's I won. Wow.